Welcome to another Kink Live performance. It is brought to us by Intel. Please welcome with me into the Bing Lounge this afternoon, Pat Travers. It's an absolute... <laughs> It's an absolute honor to have you here with us this afternoon. Steve, yes. I just want you to know I'm your biggest fan. I doubt that some, no, but it's I, true. <laughs> congratulations on your promotion. Thank you very much. Did you hear about that, the blue show kind of thing? We, we've been working that. You know, that's one thing that uh, happened with me, too, about 20 years ago. I, uh, I fell away from what I grew up on. You. Uh-oh. That's all right. All right, we're back now. We are, well, yeah. you know what? The other thing, too, you came to the blues about the same time in which I was trying to find the deeper car, uh, cut artists. So, like, uh, you know, when Gary Moore turns to the blues, Pat Travers turns to the blues tracks and everything. Where was, because, I mean, you're uh, Evie and Go All Night and all those leads were so bluesy, but the rock and roll was rock and roll. What, what did prompt you? I that? just have bluesy bones in my body. I, I, I don't know why. That's just, it's just the way I play, you know. Well, can you turn it on? Right? Here we go. I'm having a great wires and wiggle them too. Why am I not? Oh, well, this is good. Okay, something not working here, Kirk. However, uh, to get back to it, yeah, I was just born with bluesy bones. And uh, um, so, uh, but I do the rock thing too. And, and to tell you the truth, it really, we did a tour in October in Europe last year. In, to 11, 2011. When we got back, my ears were burned because we did like 19 shows in 21 days. I was just fried. So all I wanted to listen to was the blues. So I found a good blues station and just started listening to really old blues. Spent about three months doing that. And then reading their backstories and their biographies of Howl and Wolf and Muddy Water and stuff and started learning about some of the people that influenced them from the 20s and 30s, aside from Robert Johnson, who was a big influence on a lot of people, but there were a lot of other guys, like Blind Melon, Blind Lemon Jefferson, Blind Blake, all these blind guys bumping into each other. <laughs> it's funny. Uh, and, um, but, uh, so then I got asked to do a, a CD by Cleopatra, and uh, you know what, just unplug it and plug it back in, this thing, this the, thing? the power, yeah. And um, they asked me if I could do uh, 12 songs from the 1920s, and of course I could, and I did, and that album's called uh, Blues on Fire, and it comes out at the end of this month on Cleopatra. Killer. It's a really good record. <laughs> and, uh, but, I listen, one more thing, I just want to get this in. I do have my own EP, my first independent release on No Noise. You go to my Facebook page, Pat Travers Band Facebook page, and there's a link there. You can have an audio preview. It's called Dogs and Guitars. Okay, cause everybody, everybody likes dogs. Everybody likes guitars. I had my wife take a picture of me. You know, we have a bunch of dogs, a bunch of guitars, and I said, take a picture of me in front of all these dogs and guitars, and maybe everybody will like me too. Oh. <laughs> well, you're looking absolutely. I'm telling you, man. I mean. Does that look like 40 years difference? <laughs> no, that's not. <laughs> Does it? You're looking great, but what's the best thing right now about being PT in 2012? <sighs> is it life, love? Is it the music? Which is it? Uh, the music's good right now, especially th this year. I've been in the studio and creating a lot, and, uh, and uh, my creativity level is very high at the moment. It has been for several months here, and uh, it's a good thing because we're working on a new studio album for the band. Uh, for Frontiers Records that comes out next year, so and that's going to. You want to tell really us who good. you got up here yeah, before we start jamming? Uh, for us? Rodney O'Quinn on bass guitar. Yeah. yeah. Sandy Gennaro on drums. Yeah. And Kirk McKim on guitar. And I'm Patrick Henry Travers. Patrick Henry Travers. <laughs> Well, I just want to say uh, thank you so much for allowing me to air guitar to your music All during right. high school. Because yeah. <laughs> you gave me the best stuff to air guitar to. And, uh, <laughs> see? Right there. That's it. He's at the Cascade Tavern tonight, guys. And if you can't go see him, we got plenty of merch to sell afterwards. He's ready to do it to you. It is Pat Travers.